First line in the instructions, peel back the lid. I've ripped it off. I've messed up already. Ooh. The water's boiling. So, my couscous is uh, being prepared. Should be ready in about two, three minutes. Got a nice hot cup of fruit tea. I'll be filling my belly with couscous in a couple of minutes. All in all, it doesn't get much better. Excellent. And again, Really quite peaceful. There's a little bit of a wind today though. But there's moments between the breezes where it's just absolute silence. What a good way to spend your holiday. Cheers. That's nice. That's really nice. Okay, couscous is ready. Right, give you a quick look. Look at that, looks quite tasty. Right, see if I can do this without spilling. Probably not. Let's see, let's see. Can I get it to my mouth without spilling? I think so. Mmm, mmm. That's tasty. Right, I'm going to eat my couscous. I'm going to finish my brew. And then I'll make a decision about what to do next. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do, but I'll mull it over, over some couscous and a nice cup of tea. I'm so glad I found my sunglasses. Really happy. Okay, I'm off of Greymoor Hill, which is up that way. I'm back on a path. If I follow the path in that direction, it'll take me to the, the west end of Hill of Fair, where the high point is. And if I go in that direction, it'll take me back towards my car. The path is not gonna be that easy. Let me show you the path. You see it there, and if I come around here as well. The path's got a lot of snow on it. Uh, you could do it, I could do it, but it's gonna take longer. And the path goes up over this side here, and I think it winds around that way, and then goes all the way up to the high point. Either way, it's gonna take me a long time to get up there. And for every hour I spend going in that direction, I have to spend an extra hour coming back in this direction. So I'm left with a dilemma. If I leave and go back to the car now, I've got quite a short day. I need a really long day to go in that direction. So I don't know what to do. I don't particularly want to go back to the car yet, but at the same time, I don't particularly want to waste any time heading that direction if I'm not gonna get anywhere. 
So, I'm not sure. I mean, I could head up over a Meikle Tap again, like I did on Friday, and come back down over the ridge and through the woods. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure. At this particular moment in time, I don't really want to cut my day short, but at the same time, I'm thinking I've had quite a successful day. I've managed to uh, find my sunglasses, which I'm incredibly happy about. And I've uh, tried out the jet boil on top of a hill, which was nice. And I've seen some really nice views. So I'm kind of tempted just to cut the day short, just say, you know, successful mission, found my glasses, go home, put your feet up, have a nice cup of tea at home. Do really want to head over there, but uh, again, you really need the path to be in good condition to get in that direction. Uh, well, I could make it, but if I want to get over there fast and see the views and have time to get back to the car, then I need the path to be in better condition because it is a long day. It's a long day out, so that's not an option. So I'm afraid that, uh, I mean, I'm walking through the snow here and it's pretty tough. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna encounter a lot of this and as I get higher, you know, there are areas up there where could there easily be drifts and I'm gonna have this kind of situation. So yeah, I think I'm gonna cut it short. I'm gonna head home and uh, get this latest stuff loaded up to YouTube.